710 ESPN Seattle presents Brock and Salk's Wrap Up. Powered by the law offices of Heidi Hunt. No, it wasn't a bar mitzvah or any other formal ceremony, but Tony Roten became a man this week. What does that mean for the Huskies? That's next. You know, you watch this Husky basketball team play this year, and they just haven't had that one go-to guy that can step up and really take them to the next level, right? We've seen it with Isaiah Thomas in the last couple of years. Before that, it was Quincy Pondexter. It's always been a staple, really, of most good basketball teams, but certainly of this Husky team recently, of that one guy that mans up when you need him to. Well, is Tony Roten that guy? He's shown a little bit right now, and they go to the desert, they win at Arizona State, then they win at Arizona, and when they need somebody to step up and go to the next, that next level to be the true man that they need. It has been Tony Rowe. Terrence Ross, very good, very athletic player who may very well become a good NBA player based on his potential. But does he have that aggressiveness? Does he have, he's, a, he's clutch, not taking anything away from the shooting, but is he the guy that demands the ball in those big moments and goes right after the rim? No, he's not. That's what Tony Roten has been. And we'll get to watch now in the second half of the Pac-12 season whether or not that's enough to carry them into the tournament. And if it is, what kind of a dangerous team they could be once they get there.